We're gonna do a little follow-up. We got Timber back. Uh, Timber, tell me how you did overnight again. Uh, very well. Yeah? Uh, no pain? No pain. You didn't need a pain medicine? I, no pain medicine. You took the antibiotics? I did. Okay, and this drained a little bit. I can see uh, Gummy Jean just took the dressing off. So, let me tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and pull this packing out, and then we're gonna squirt in some lidocaine to give you a little, a little pain relief and then we're gonna have to repack it for the weekend. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Okay, on two, one, ooh. Oh, she learned from that the best. That was like 10. She totally cheated you on your you okay? three. Yeah, I did feel a little burnt. A little sting there. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get a look down into the wound now. Gee, it looks like an eye. Okay. Eye socket. Yeah. <laughs> an eye socket. It's looking pretty good. All right, now let's get that numbing medicine in there. Just a little squirt. This is such an easy step, and I, and I hope that there are a lot of providers out there that are watching this because, you know, when I was trained in medical school, we didn't do this. The lidocaine? We just, yeah, we just repacked them. I mean, it's like, okay, take a deep breath and hang on, pal. This is going <laughs> to hurt. You know, you want some rawhide to bite down on. Well, that's how we were taught. You know, that's wrong. Yeah. You don't have to do that. We can squirt a little medicine in there, and uh, it'll, it actually works. Works just fine. Well, let's just put it this way. It helps a lot, you know? All right, so we're going to take a two-minute break, and then we'll come right back. A couple of minutes, and we're going to get Gummy Jean now to go ahead and let's get this packed. Now, uh, Timber, if it hurts, just tell us we'll slow down. She's going to take her time, and she's just yeah. going to kind of slowly put the ribbon back in. And this is iodoform gauze, which is uh, basically um, gauze that's impregnated with an uh, iodine. Impregnated? Product. Impregnated, that's what she's got. It has stuck to it and in between the fibers an iodine product, which is an antiseptic and uh, natural kind of uh, antibiotic. You don't feel any pain, do you? Did it hurt, bud? No, I'm good. So she can keep poking in. She's going to make it kind of tight in there. I want this to stay open all the way to the bottom so the healing can occur from the inside out. We do want you to keep taking those antibiotics over the weekend, though, right? Okay. okay. I'm glad you didn't have enough pain to need uh, pain for yesterday. It feels weird. It's okay. You have to tuck it up in there, okay? Because there's kind of a there's kind of a pouch that this thing holds. Yeah, that's the direction. Okay. Do you feel a little of that? I'm do. sorry. Here's a new one. I was wondering how all of this stuff fit in this tiny hole that I thought was tiny. It's not tiny. But it's actually deep. Yeah, you said it was an inch and a half or so. Oh, absolutely. And if you need my help, you just say uh, Okay. I think I got it. Feeling any pain, buddy? No, I'm good. Good. That uh, light came was fast. Almost got it done there, Mr. Timber. Okay. Push that in there. There you go. All right. Well, all look, right. At look at that. Get one little, little. All right. Just leave that in there all weekend now. Okay. It looks like lips. It does. It looks like it looks <laughs> like a like set they're up. ready to kiss. Yeah, like lips like that are kind of uh, ready to give you a little smooch. <laughs> um, okay. Well, anyway. Uh, Good job. Thanks for letting us uh, video your follow-up, and we'll see you on Monday, okay? Okay, you're welcome. Yeah, on the camera. We're back with our pal Timber. Timber, how's it going, buddy? Oh, good. Okay, so you had this packing in over the weekend. Looks like you did a good job of not pulling it out. Thank you very much. Do you have any problems? Uh, no. Papers, chills, pain, nothing? No. I haven't even eaten any pain medication. Well, that's fantastic. All right, Gumby Jean's going to just remove the packing now. So we have the iodoform pack in there, so she's going to pull it out. On the count of three. Count One, two, three. Good. Okay, so that looks pretty clear. We have one little, little spot in there. Can we bring that forceps back over here and see if that'll just come right out carefully? See that little in there? See that just come out. 
Yeah, so that's not really in there. Okay, so you're healing, and the good thing is this is doing a great job of staying open, so we can we don't have to pack this anymore. Okay. Woohoo! What do you think about that? Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah, that's good. All right, so this is going to take time. It's going to heal from the inside out, and all you're going to have to do going forward is just finish your antibiotics and keep a dry dressing on this. Okay. Okay? Now, if at any point you feel like you're having any trouble with it, if the... Uh, you know, wound feels like it's getting infected or the drainage from it's, you know, turned uh, dark or you get a foul smell or something, just let us know or come back in, okay? Okay. Any questions? No, that's it. Well, well you've been a great patient. Thank you. Thanks for letting us record your, the whole saga, <laughs> the whole thing. All right, bud, we're here for you if you need us. All right, thank you. Stay tuned for the Meta 7 video. Okay, tell us about Meta 7. Um, I love it and my hair is not falling off at all now just a little few hairs here and there So you had a big hair loss problem. Yes, I did and now It's perfect. It's been great. It's like normal hair. Mm-hmm. You did better. Awesome. And you like the way you feel on it? Yes, I do <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay good. Well, thanks. Thank you See the kid Ow, ow, ow. Where's the kitty? Where's the kitty? Where's the kitty? Two meetings a couple weeks ago. Uh -huh. He don't have a right eye. He lost his eye. He had a bite. Uh -huh. he, he got his left eye. Yeah. Uh, I feel sorry for the eater, but that's Mother Nature and I. So he's gonna. He probably won't last very long with just one eye. Yeah, we don't feed him. But he still can hunt. Though he still can see off the side. I just seen him with legs missing. All that there. You see the bite marks on the side? Yeah. That's from me. Huh. I gotta get a grab him.